going on guys, it's Panda here, and today's video we're actually going to be reacting to some of the old videos of uh, Panda's Curse. Uh, I called these first two videos Panda's Curse Classics, they were originally on like, a different channel, and then like way before I started doing them regularly, I guess. Uh, I'm also joined by a dog here, if um, all kind of. Uh, basically just being joined by my sister's dog, uh, because I'm supposed to kind of be looking after him. Uh, but he, 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 I couldn't really like leave him by himself, because he kind of gets bored without anyone. Uh, so, yeah, I'm kind of, I'm also the only one in the house, so I, I'm kind of, I'm kind of forced to be with, uh, him, so, uh, it's great. Uh, so yeah, so, like I said, the first two Panda Scares classic videos, uh, well, the first two Panda Scares videos, which are kind of called classic, uh, because I re-upload them onto this channel that you're watching this on, and yeah, I thought it might be, uh, enjoyable to watch, because they're kind of funny, because, like, it were, were made for almost, well, this one was made three years ago, and the next one's almost three years. Uh, so they're kind of funny because I'm like a little bit younger, but at the same time I don't feel like I aged that much. I was 14 uh, in this video, and I'm like uh, 17 now. Uh, so yeah, let's uh, just get straight into it. Uh, so it's the Tomini... I'm trying to do right. The Tomini's Hell's Curse video. And uh, there's not really much to say, so I'm going to play... Uh, Hello everyone, now. it's Panda here from The Debunkers. This is going to be a new channel where we're going to so, be taking a look at some demons. I was going to want to commentary over this, so it's not just me reacting it. Them and um, I realised I so said... The okay, first thing, I want to pause it. First thing, I realised how I said the debunkers channels, because that was originally the name of the channel I wanted to, uh, I wanted to upload these on. Uh, like, before, and now that channel's gone, and kind of replaced this one, I guess, uh, years later. Uh, I also realised my dog's... Uh, the dog's just <laughs> distracting me right now. I've also, I also realised that the, um, uh, the music, I think the music just been, like, added in, like, I don't think the first time I uploaded this, I added it, because, like, I uploaded it a few times, because originally, like, I made a channel, decided not to, and then, I don't know, like, I feel like originally when this uploaded, I don't feel like the music was there, I think like, that's something I added in, um, like, later, I think, um, I don't know if I'm a fan of the music, I feel like the music can be a little bit distracted. I feel like I want to get uh, straight to the point of these. Anyway, let's uh, continue it. Um, the foamy hell curse. Um, I got it on my phone right here. And what this curse is supposed to do, it's supposed to... Another thing. I also realised I'm looking around. It was a little bit... It was really hard to record because of, like people keep getting into the shot. And this is a few one of the few times where like I'm in public, but without like a forest, because like, it's easy to hide in the forest. Um... So, yeah, it was kind of a little bit uh, nervous to do them. Or near a forest. I realised a couple of the ones I did with uh, Brett somewhat recently weren't actually in a forest, but they were, like, near, like, a field, and there were barely any people in there. But this is somewhere, like, people would come by regularly, so... Kill you. So, it's um, hard. so, if I do die in any of these, I'm going to have my lovely cameraman here to um, put it on YouTube. So, yeah. Alright, so... Full skin. I also realise, um... I was slightly inspired by Lucas Creepers. I obviously still am, um, but I try to try. I try to do things differently now. But I realise this is starting to sound a lot like his first video on, uh, like his own kind of sim uh, series. Um, you know where I say so I start off by doing doing his curse, which is a very easy one. It's like I feel like it's a good one to start with. But I also say things like my cameraman's gonna upload it, which I think is something similar to what he said. I believe. Uh, also. I moved now because people kept getting into my shot and it was really distracting uh, when you're trying to do rituals and stuff. You may have noticed Play. that you have changed locations, that is because um, people kept getting in the way of the shoot and kept interrupting the recording. So we're recording it here. So without further ado, I'll go on my phone, let's um, start doing it. His older sister vomited blood, his younger sister vomited bile, an acute Munio vomited glass beads. Fell into hell alone. Hell is wrapped in darkness and even the flowers don't bloom. In the person was the whip, Domino's older sister. I wonder whose blood is on it. Hit, hit, without hitting. Impotent hell's one road. Would you hit, leave him in- Also, pause. I do apologise that the camera's a little bit shaky and I realise there is a lot of things- Okay, is it just me or do I hear something? Okay, I feel really, like, scared. Like, I don't know. I just feel like something's going on. Um, I also realised there's stuff in the background, which is slightly weird. 
Um, I don't know what the hell's going on in the background. The dark hell. The sheep of gold to the butcher wobbler. Fit as much as you can into the leather sack. For the preparation of journeys in the familiar hell. Spring is coming, even in the forest and the stream. Even in the seven valleys dreams of in the dark hell. The bush wobbler in the bird cage as a sheep in the wagon. Yeah, thanks for getting this way. Cry the bush wobbler towards the rain forest. He shouts that he misses his little sister. The crying echoes of um, rather great throughout hell. The fox ponyo blooms, um, circling around hell's seven mountains and seven streams. The lonely journey of future Romeo. If they're in hell, bring them to me. The needles of the grave. I will pierce them with the red needle in the milestone of little Romeo. So, um. That was the English version. I'm, I'm now gonna record it in Japanese. Um, yeah, so far, nothing like wrong with me. I feel perfectly fine. So let's just read the Japanese version. All right. So sorry about that, guys. We can't record it in Japanese. That is because there isn't enough storage on my friend's phone. So I'm just gonna end the video here. So far, there's nothing wrong with me. In the next video, I'll just do like a little catch up saying if anything happened um, since this video but for now um, this is it I'm okay and hopefully I'll see you all in the next video is that because you don't scare anyone because I remembered I actually watched this the other day like when I was going through these so I had to re-upload it and I it generally made me jump I forgot I, I forgot he did that that was like not planned I was thinking my cameraman did or my friend Brett which still uh, does uh, who, who still does these with me? Um, moving on to the next one, part two, and both of these I've actually redone. So there is somewhat of a modern, a modern. I mean, these came out in two thousand seventeen. I don't really know if I can call new ones modern, but I, I did end up redoing uh, these. So let's play the next one now. Hey guys, it's Panda here from the Debunkers, and I'm coming I have not back changed. out with another I urban kinda... myth. So, Do I still look like that? today I'm going to be doing the suicide girl drawing, where you basically have to... I don't know. Uh, stare also, I realize I'm doing this, I don't know a photo for too long, where I am. Like, I don't know where the face cam is. So, as you can see, I'm still alive from the last one we did. I do apologise though, considering that was Pause. all the way back in what like July. What is the Now it's December, so I do apologise for the long way. The going like, flashing between dark and bright. And yeah, so this one's a bit short one, but should be creepier um, still. So I will have the photo like up here. Oh, pause again. I realise this is the last one was in July 2017. This one's December. I am now we're now like 15, and it was like such a massive gap. I'm glad right now I'm somewhat keeping the series up with like my goal now is to do them like once every two weeks for the time being. Uh, but you know sometimes might change. Um, but yeah, I feel like I kept them somewhat consistent now. Uh, when I bring back in 2019, the end of it, December, I think I started doing again. Down like. here, as you guys are watching, so you guys can see exactly what I'm staring at. So, as you can see, it's pretty creepy, and we'll go stare at it for about a minute. I don't know if I'm going to show like the whole entire minute, um, but I'll show you uh, some of it. So, I'm staring at it now, and we're going to see if it kills me or not. So, I don't know exactly if it's going to take too long, like, I don't know if it's going to do like a rapid kill me. Or if it's just going to be like over the next few days, it's kind of Oops, kill, killing me. Um, but yeah, so I don't expect me to uh, get killed from this one, but we're going to test it out and see if it does. So um, at the moment it's 3.56, so I'm going to wait until 3.57. Okay, so I'm going to go in and see what it as you can see, what really annoys me, live. that my hands are a little bit would have picked up, just probably picked up, just have picked up where it says one minute later, that would have been way more fitting. So, I'm still live, I will update you guys in the next one, if I still survive for that one, so, like I said, I do apologise, this one was a pretty short one, especially how last video was in July the 15th, and this is now December, um, yeah, hopefully I'll keep these more consistent, and, yeah, just, hopefully, thank you for watching, I, I do appreciate you for watching, and I hope to see you all in the next one. Okay, so that was the reaction to the Panda Scares Classic videos. Um, I was debating not to do this because I feel like... I, I always like the idea of like reaction to old videos, it's just that they feel like once you do them, you can't do them again because 
There's only so many times you can react to an old video, but then eventually this is going to be old. And like, would it be weird if I react to this one of me reacting to that, or should I like re-react or something? I don't know if that's like, I don't know. But then again, they're three years old, or almost going to be three years old. I feel like it's about time. Maybe I should have done a reaction with my cameraman, but uh, all well. Uh, thank you guys for so much watching. I hope you did enjoy them. Uh, I, I'm curious now, like, you, I, I, I feel like I look the same. I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm not playing the video anymore. Um, but I was just curious to know what other people think. Cause, like, I feel like I look the same uh, from back then. Uh, like, I don't know. I feel like most people change from 14 to 17. Um, but uh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I do, but I, I don't feel like I look that much different. Um, I feel like I'm a little bit more confident in my voice. I feel like that's something that's changed because I feel like now I can talk to a camera a little bit more easier, especially in public. I feel like it was really hard because I don't think I've really done anything like that. Now it's a little bit more easier, I guess, because, I mean, it's still a little bit awkward, but I don't know. Anyway, uh, this video is dragging on uh, too long, which is something the old videos did not do. Uh, so thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you've got any ideas of things I should do, I uh, hope you enjoyed this little bonus video this week. And yeah, thank you very much, and I hope to see you all, all in the next one. Bye.